Hi, I just wanted to do a review about this bike I've bought. Um, before I bought it, I tried to do uh, a quick YouTube search and find some reviews which were relevant, and they were all pretty rubbish. Um, I'm sorry if that's you. So I thought I'd do a little bit more accurate review. So it's a Euro bike G4. Uh, I think it looks quite nice, which is good. It wasn't too expensive. 250 quid I pay for it and uh, it's, a, it's a folding bike so the good bits and the bad bits the good bits are it's pretty easy to fold up I find the brakes are really good as well the gears are nice and smooth easy to change no problems there really nice um, they're all a bit cheap but uh, yeah it's absolutely fine uh, what else do I like about it um, Saddle's pretty good. Saddle's quite comfortable. Uh, all in all, it's quite nice to ride. So the downside of it is, it is a little bit on the heavy side, which, to be honest with you, I don't really notice when I'm riding along. This uh, shock, I mean, I don't know why folding bikes need to have rear suspension. I mean, I don't have them on any of my other mounts of bikes, uh, and it's rubbish. So I weigh 75 kilos, and it bottoms out straight away. That's pretty poor. Uh, no quick release on the wheels. Uh, I'm all right with that, actually. Uh, I don't really want quick release. Uh, what else have we got? So the main thing I found was it was agony to ride. Uh, the reach here was really bad. And I've just put this uh, extender up on the stem, giving it a couple more inches and uh, it's made a world of difference. Um, I can definitely do a lot more distance now. Uh, the other thing that's a bit weird, uh, and the, well, the handlebars are the wrong way around, so back, the brakes rather the wrong way around, so back is front, front is back. Just be a little bit mindful of that. The tyres it came with are, are fine as well. I mean, none of it is really good quality. I have to say the wel welds look a bit rubbishy. Um, you know it is what it is folding bikes are expensive but the main thing is is it folds up really really quickly once it's folded up you can't carry it it's not really got anywhere to hold it to take it onto a tube or a bus or anything like that but for me it folds straight up very easily uh, saddle drops straight away and it goes into my boat um, which is the main reason of having it. So there's not much spare room on the boat. Uh, that folds up, tucks in the wheel deck, no problems. I'm five foot eight, nearly five foot nine, and saddle is full extension, and it's just about enough. Um, so if you're anything more than five eight, five nine, I don't know. You could change the saddle stem, I suppose. Pedals are cheap. Um, everything's a bit cheap as I said but it's fine, it's fine uh, I think it looks alright uh, I'm not too ashamed to be riding it but there you go, uh, any comments, any questions anything you want to know if I can help you um, leave a comment below cheers